Hey, it's Robert Scoville. So we're uh, at the very first uh, Mud Crutch gig. We're at the Ogden Theater in Denver, Colorado. Uh, so I'm just going to take you in and give you a little walkthrough today. Going to give you a little uh, walkthrough of the front of house rig. And we'll kind of get out if I can do this without falling here. <laughs> Almost. All right, so here we are at uh, front of house position. Uh, I'll give you a little run through of what we got going on at front of house here. Uh, again, we're at the Ogden Theater in Denver. Uh, we've got Mud Crutch here tonight, opening night of the tour. Uh, Shelter opening up for them, really good band as an opener. Uh, so you can see we're on uh, uh, S6L, I've got a 32D here. Um, so we come down to the racks, let's see if I can light on here so we can show what's going on down here. Actually, I'll start over here. Uh, this is the main processing rack. You got an uh, E6L144 here. Uh, as you can see, I got about a half dozen Mac Minis doing various odd jobs. I got one dedicated to the flux analyzer, uh, one dedicated to smarts, uh, three others that are dedicated to Pro Tools record, like a main record, uh, a redundant record, which we haven't incorporated yet. Uh, as well as a surround record. Also, I have an iTunes server in there for walk-in music and also for keeping all rough mixes, etc. Uh, there's an Mbox Pro up there. That's what I use for my smart rig. Uh, above that, you can kind of see my electrosonics receivers for some wireless uh, stuff for uh, doing smart analysis, etc. If we move over to this rack, you can see we got a couple of uh, LM44s up there. I'm going to use those on a daily basis to do our uh, PA tunings, etc. Uh, there's also an E3 engine in here. I'm using that for two-track record as well as the surround record. It's doing all the surround record for me. I just bring my surround and ambience mics in there as well as all my subgroups off the console uh, and two-track mixes and just create a surround environment in that uh, Pro Tools session. Uh, that's the Stage 16 which is capturing all of those inputs, etc. As we move over here, we've got a couple pieces of outboard gear. We've got a pair of uh, Eventide H3000 SCs. Uh, and that's really just because I haven't been able to find anything in AAX DSP uh, for venue yet uh, that I think is suitable for what I want to do. Also, I have a DBX1, uh, what is it, 120X, 120A down there. Although I've been using Pro Sub uh, Harmonic, the uh, Avid sub bass uh, generator with great effect that's been really good so far uh, as we move up here we'll see we have an e3 service set up here for my system engineer andrew dowling say hello andrew hello hey there uh, andrew's going to be mixing the opening act on the s3 uh you can see our lake computer there we're doing uh, system tuning in the places we go to and of course here's our external screen uh, that works off KVM. We can pull up any uh, any of those Mac Minis uh, and see those and operate them there. You can see our smart case for the day. Uh, today we're on a pretty good sized Macaulay rig. You're not going to be able to see it because it's dark in here. But, uh, really big rig here. Pretty good sounding once we got into it and tuned it up a little bit. Uh, you can see Shelter up on stage there. They're getting ready to do a little sound check here. So. All right, so that's front of house position. Opening night for Mud Crutch. Um, I'll try to check in on a daily basis, let you know what we run into on a daily basis out on this little club tour. We're going to be taking this around. Uh, I'll try to get you through the monitor rig at some point before we go, so uh, or before we finish. Uh, but that's about it for here. All right, we just finished up the first night here in Denver. Uh, really successful night. Band had a great, great time on stage tonight. Pretty good sounding room. Uh, the Macaulay PA did pretty good, so uh, we're off to Chicago tomorrow morning. I'll give you guys another report from then. Uh, if you reply to these uh, little blog posts and uh, ask me to cover something or want me to show you something on the system, just post it on there. I'll try to cover it in one of the little blogs. I'm always looking for content and subject matter, so uh, give me a buzz. Let me know what's going on. I hope you enjoy these. We'll stay in touch. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.